time for the one Drew challenge. Let's go. So, how do I play this out? Because the Druid is one interesting fella. Like, I know for sure going Pop Lust is probably going to be useless. Because, like, uh, the Pop Lust is good if you spam them, but we can only get one. So, I'm thinking Top Path only. So, first Heart Thorns. I'm thinking Path 1 and Path 3. Because you know why Path 3? Well, one for the range. And two, if we can leak 100 lives, we're actually going to get a really, really fast-firing Druid. Does anybody know if the attack speed affects, like, the Thunder? Like, if I get this upgrade, and if I get the Whirlwind upgrade, do those shoot faster if I get this upgrade? It does? Oh shit, that's great. That's perfect. Like, if we upgrade to Thunder, here's the plan. We're not going to get a Village, we're going to let it leak. So that we get uh, the attack speed. Yeah, once we get below 100 lives, we will get back our village. And I also believe if we sell if we sell the druid, then we get screwed because if we sell it and we buy it, the technically correct term. Yeah, if I sell we buy it, I lose the attack speed. So I have a feeling that like we're not going to survive very far, like the moment we sell this guy. So double attack speed if we lose. 100 lives or more. That's pretty good. How much is a Superstorm actually? On oh, easy mode. 76.5k, huh. Like, we were able to afford the Flying Fortress. So buy the upgrade first. Yeah, you have to buy it. You can't leak lives and then buy it. You won't get the buff that way. Because it only counts after you buy it. Spirit of Forest, yeah. Assuming we can't afford um, the Superstorm, because like by far the Superstorm is the best thing ever. I mean, also Avatar of Wrath, that's pretty good. Yeah, I know a lot of people are saying like the Superstorm is like mostly support, but it still does pretty good, does it not? Like, on its own. Granted, I have never used it before in a real game, or very little at least. We're still sitting on 200, so no attack speed bonus. So we'll let all these camos leak. This'll take us down to like 140, I think. Somewhere like that. An Avatar Wrath is solo bad on its own? Like, we're talking without other pop lusts. Because I'm pretty sure without pop lusts, we probably can't do that. And I think we'll let the whites leak next round as well, so... At that point, we're gonna get the bonus. Let's see how much we have after this. 108, okay. Okay, slow down. I, I'll buy the upgrade right now. Okay, so we're down to 68 lives. A little bit overkill. 58. Either way, 100 lives or 58. We got the double attack speed go bonus going on. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna make a decision. Pop Lust first. And then Avatar Wrath after. I'm pretty sure we can save off for that. I mean, it's only 38k. Just a measly 38k, okay? This mob, though, that's gonna take a while to, to get popped. Please don't tell me we're gonna leak to this. Seriously, no. We're not dead, right? Yeah, we're dead. <laughs> well then. Again, the thing is, I can't sell it. Like, if I sell it, I lose the bonus. So what do I do? Like, we all know if you spam, like, 5 druids... You're, you're set. You're set till round like 200. But with one druid, you have less leeway. Plan? 013. It won't have any attack speed because of these lost lives, but this is how we do it. It's the only way to do it, actually. Lots of selling and buying. And when they pop, we get this. Tornado, oh, perfect. Pro tip, if you upgrade your Tornado, it will immediately drop a Tornado. So you can use this to your advantage. Hold on, let's try to beat this first. We're not in the clear yet. But all right, there it is, 45 completes. We can close the chapter on that book. Let's play the round. 
But now what? Do we go for ball lightning or should we go for the avatar? Or what do we do? Do we leak lives? Do we try to drop below CC5 right now? Let's get to Heart of Vengeance. Okay, here's what I'm thinking, yeah. Leak lives, drop below 165, and then buy Ball Lightning. 82. Okay, almost, almost. 68, or 65. We need 65 lives, and then... Ah, we're so, sh so close. Okay, we just need to lose 6 more lives, okay? This 6% attack speed is important. Even though it's only 6%, I care about that 6%. Does anybody know how much damage the Ball Lightning does to Moabs? Because I'm thinking, if we can beat the Moab with just Ball Lightning, then we don't have to sell. Uh, let's just buy it anyways, I think. Should I? Yeah, 6%, fuck that. You'll never be screwed if I have skill. Well, that's one way to put it. Do I have the skill to make it past, like, the 50s? I don't know. Is it even possible? Don't forget Ball Lightning freezes balloons with monkey knowledge. Oh, does it? Is it freezing right now? I'm pretty sure I have the monkey knowledge for all that. I have, like, maxed MK. Also, uh, we are actually damaging Moab. Huh. Okay, I'm thinking we might not need to sell it if we get lucky. Yeah, they're freezing. They're freezing, alright. If we get lucky with our tornado. Cross fingers, please. Come on. I believe it's gonna pop, like, over here. So we just have to get a very good tornado. And we're Gucci. Yes, like that. Perfect. To all the doubters of this guy. I think this is the way to go, though. Definitely the way to go. Okay, that was pretty good. We should have done this from the start, man, what the hell? Like, I didn't even need to get a pop lust, or... Like, I could have just gone for a straight ball lightning at the start. And who would have been fine for 40? Now, who was the people who said the, the ball lightning was ass versus uh, Moabs? Because it actually did a lot. Yeah, now the plan is to survive to Avatar. Because I don't think we can save up this much. I mean, it would be nice to, but I doubt it. Now, the only issue this time is, uh, if we do get an Avatar of the Wrath, which we have to sell, it won't have the buffed attack speed. So I don't know how to leak lives between then. Maybe we don't upgrade it until I leak lives, I don't know. That's the only way I see it working. Like, how good is a plain, uh, Avatar without buffs? No attack speed, nothing. I reckon not that great. Oh, three SRAMs. Oh no. Oh yes. This is way too close. Although luckily we have like, uh, double attack speed tornadoes. I think that's why we're able to blow back everything. Because I never recall this being that good. Like there were so many times where like, the SRAMs were about to leak, but clutch tornado coming in. Bold move. Sell. We will get a pop lust right now. 204. Don't upgrade it yet. I will wait until I leak lives. If we do leak lives this round. 46, 38, buy now. 30 lives. 30 lives. 11, 8. Nope, 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 that was too much. So apparently Avatar of Wrath is not that strong unless you leave it uh, popping for a while. Sell village like camels leak. There's too many camels around, I can't do that. Not enough RBE to bring out the Avatar's power. That might be it. In which case, that kind of sucks. Uh, Avatar now. Let's try to leak as much as we can, but... Holy crap, this thing is weak. It's like doing no damage, what the fuck? Well, that kind of sucks. Now what? No, you know what? Uh, stay with us for this round. And we'll see what to do for round 60. Like, I 99.9% .9 doubt it. But if we can beat round 60 with just this one druid, that would be pretty dope. Because I was thinking we couldn't beat 60 with this, so that's why I sold it for the avatar. I don't think we can do this. It's not strong enough. Too much HP on the BFB. 
I can only hope, but that's a lot of SRAMs to blow back if it even pops. And I don't think it will pop. Oh wait, it did pop. Now we got it lucky. Pray to RNG that our tornadoes are our clutch. Come on, tornadoes. Uh, do I leak that? How many balloons are, are, are in here? Do I dare risk it? Do it. Okay, I'm doing it. Holy crap, we're still alive. We lost three lives. Well, I definitely severely under underestimated the power of this guy. Holy crap. I did not know this thing was so good. Of course, credit to Tornado, because otherwise without Tornado we would not be able to pop the ceramics. Or rather, like, it would not blow back the ceramics back here. And we'd be super dead. Can we get Superstorm? How much are we off? 30k. No. I'm pretty sure we're dead for uh, 65. Like, if we can barely beat 63, uh, 60. How do you think we can beat 65 with two BFAs? Uh, also, purple balloons. Wait a minute. No, we're dead this round if we don't sell. Well, shit. Balling doesn't affect purples. Okay, this round we need uh, Avatar no matter what. No matter what. We gotta get it. Sell. That's the only way you can win this. One, two, one, two, three, four. Not buying Avatar yet. I wanna leak lives first, or you know what? Fuck it, buy it. It's her only chance of winning, so. <laughs> we gotta get the Avatar Wrath. The thing it gets weak it gets weaker the less balloons are on screen. It's based on RBA, I believe. So right now we're like we're like we're doing Gucci, but <laughs> once the round ends. It's gonna get weaker and weaker. Like for example, these regrow rainbows. Uh, regrow rainbows. Nope. Okay, I gotta put on last, last. Thornstorm. No, we need the leads. Cause I'm pretty sure someone mentioned you can't. Anyways, last, last for the regrows. I believe someone else also mentioned close, but I think we're fine. Yeah, there we go, okay. Simple targeting. And that is how, folks, you deal with Rego Farms. Here is 63, which I think it should handle, right? I mean, 63 is a lot of rams. High RB equals, uh, it can handle it, right? No? No, we can't. Can't afford it, guys. Or can I? Should I try? Throw everything at the wall here, because this guy is not strong enough, he can't, he can't do it. Back to the ball. Okay, we'll try the ball. Again, I have to mention, we don't have attack speed, which is going to hit, hurt us a lot. And if it works, it works, if it doesn't, it doesn't, but yeah, look at this, guys. Losing 50% speed hurts a lot, and we're probably dead here. No, 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 this is not gonna work. Or is it? There's no way, right? No. Nope. <laughs> okay, we'll try a Spirit of the Forest. I don't know if that's gonna help, but... Can we afford it? No, we can't. We can't afford it. Nope. Can't afford the, the, the forest. Yeah, we're gonna have to do some intense micro if we want any chance of beating this round. Don't know if we can. I'm gonna leave it on strong, though, until Wave 2 kicks in. Like, we can beat Wave 1 just fine. Now that this one is in. Um, do we sell it? Yeah, I think sell it. This. Uh, we're gonna live, so that's fine. I think. Wait a minute. We have one wave left. We might be able to do this. I don't know. That's a lot of ceramics. <laughs> you just see how clumped they were and they just, like, spread apart at the same time. Uh, yeah, just gotta hope for the Clutch Tornado, that's it. Come on, Tornadoes. You got this, right? We are that close to beating this, but we can't. No. I don't know, there's a lot of Rams over here. You see how they just blow back? All 40 of them are clumped together, and they just like... They all explode in a circle. Oddly satisfying, and we just died, uh, how? 
We're gonna rush a ball lightning because apparently that can solo round 40. Like, you don't even need to lose lives, I don't think. The druid alone to solo it, which is pretty pretty dope. So let's get ready to upgrade our radar scanner. We just need one one white balloon, that's it. I'll try to time this properly, so I'll do this. Now. Okay, that is pretty good. That is... That is what I call perfection, boys. How do I pop all the purples? That's the question. That's what killed me the other time. Like, do I leave on last? Or do I put back the first? I feel like either way I might not be able to survive this round. This might not, might not even be doable, guys. I like to think it is, but it probably is not. Back to first. Just way too many mobs and like, the purples cock block me. Nope, this is getting too far. We just don't have the mall party power. We don't. Oh wait, we died. How? Okay, let me just continue. I know this is this is kind of against the rules, but let me just see if this is possible, okay? I just have to remember that I spent how much money did I get from this? 5k? From the continue? I think it was 5k. So yeah, this round definitely 205. I just wanna see if we can beat round 63. That's all that's all I'm hoping for. I believe last time we were not able to afford uh the 050. How much can we afford it this time though? Let me see. This is cheating. You know why? Because we sent we got money for the uh continue. And that's the only reason we can afford this. But fuck it, we'll get it. Just know that uh the druid dies at 63. This is uh not part of the quote unquote achievements. The cap is definitely 63. Again, not part of the uh, record. Can this 250 actually solo this round? Like, I've never used this ability before, but... Like, what does it even do? So, essentially it's like a global nuclear reactor, I guess. That does damage over time. Anyways, I think we're gonna die this round. We are definitely dead, yeah. Okay, so so much for that. It only allows us to, uh... One extra round. Just one more round with the continue.